Let's play Gran Turismo Episode 2. I haven't done anything since the last episode. I haven't even farmed any money. So let's get on to the second race of the uh, Sunday Cup. So this one is at midfield. And uh, not much more you can really say about it. I've done these races so many times, it's ridiculous. Alright. So, um, this race being two laps around midfield, uh, if you're wondering by the, uh, if you're wondering, uh, we won't get to any races that I haven't done for another, I believe, a race, then we can get into the Amateur Cup, which, uh, or the, I mean the Clubman Cup, which is, uh, it's a little bit more difficult than this, but not much, and I think it provides the same amount of money, but, uh, whatever. So for those who don't know, uh, I've been playing Gran Turismo since 2006. So in 2006, if I was born in 2002, I would have been, uh, would have been four. So, uh, I've been playing these games since I was really little. So that's pretty much the reason why I'm good at them. Um, I remember I got Gran Turismo 4 in, I think, 2008. And then got Gran Turismo 5 in 2012. Then, uh, 6 in 2013. So I've got a long history of Gran Turismo under my, under my belt. Um, so to me, it, it is pretty easy. Being able to uh, do these races, it's, it's just fun. I'm not going to say I'm very professional at it. I'm just saying that I can do better than, uh, than people who uh, have played other racing games. Because, for those who don't know about the Gran Turismo series, it's a driving simulator. So it's a lot harder to control cars in this game than it is in, say, Need for Speed or uh, Grand Theft Auto. Uh, in here, you know, the cars will, in this game, the cars will sway and spin and, uh, grip up just like a real car would. So, you can guarantee that if someone's played, like, uh, Need for Speed their whole life and then tries to do, uh, a race in this game, they're not going to do it all that cleanly because of the fact that it's not easy to control the cars. At least, uh, not when all the assists are off. I, right now, have the assists on some medium settings just to avoid the risk of embarrassing myself, but as we go on in the series, uh, I will turn those assists off, just because um, I don't need them, I just, you know, I like them just for a little bit of added uh, protection to make me look a little more professional with this game. Because uh, the thing is, I, uh, the newer Gran Turismo's are almost incomparable to the old ones. Like, uh, after Gran Turismo 4, when they got when they switched to PlayStation 3 instead of PS2, uh, the handling in the cars became totally different. The game became a lot easier. So the like Gran Turismo 3 or Gran Turismo 4 and below are very challenging. Gran Turismo 5 and up isn't very challenging at all. So you know I'm not as good at these games as I used to be because of the fact that you know I used to just play like Gran Turismo. Uh, Five and Gran Turismo Six, which was a lot easier, as I said. So there's the second race is in the uh, Sunday Cup. I'll just uh, save game night here, and then I'll end off this episode. Um, I hope you guys enjoy these videos. I definitely enjoy making them because you know I get to relive when I was a kid. You know I get to relive when I was you know, four or five years old playing Gran Turismo 3 on my new PS2, you know? It just brings out a lot of memories for me, uh, being able to 
play this game and you know you guys watch it so i'll see you in the next video and i really sincerely hope you enjoy these ones because uh you know i'm i'm gonna keep making them and uh yeah